Hey guys, it's Tim here, and today I'll be reviewing Audio Pen, which is one of the coolest AI products that I've purchased myself this year. Audio Pen allows you to start rambling in your microphone, and then it converts your messy thoughts into a clear text. This product is really amazing. I think you will be surprised by the output that it creates. And I'm using this product all the time to, to write my emails right now. I'm using this to contact my developers because I'm not a native English speaker, but AudioPen, uh, wow, it creates such clear messages. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a live example where I'm going to ask my developer to change the login process or the registration process for a mobile app that I'm creating right now. So let me show you a live example where I'm going to start recording. So as you can see, you have a record button here. And when I click record, watch what happens. Hey, Parasit, Tim here. Um, I would like to know if we can change our registration process of our meditation app. Right now, it's pretty complicated for new users to register for the app so they can start using it. So right now they need to um, uh, download the app, then they need to fill out their email address, they need to create a password, then an email will be sent to the user where they need to click a link to confirm their email address, then they need to open the app uh, and uh, they need to log in with the password that they needed to remind. It's pretty complicated and we noticed that uh, a lot of new app applications, their email addresses are not confirmed. Now, my question is, can we change this process and make it simpler? Can we simplify this process? Uh, my thoughts are that uh, I would like to know if it is possible when a user downloads the app that they can fill out their email address and then uh, they can check their email for a login password, a one-time password that they can use to fill out and then uh, they can log in. So this will be much easier because then they don't have to remember their passwords uh, and they can simply uh, open their email and log into the app. So I think this will be a lot easier than simply, you know, um, have to register, remember their passwords, etc. blah, blah, blah. So is this possible? And how much is this going to cost? So... Now you can see this is the message that I was rambling into my mic. And sometimes I also repeat certain parts. And what Audio Pen now will do is it will create a perfect message. It will also take out every duplicate part that I said about password, reminding passwords, etc. It's simply going to write a perfect small note. It will even make it two times smaller than all the talking that I did. So I'm going to show you the outcome. And there we have it. So it takes about a minute time and look at this. It's going to create a title. So it says simplifying meditation app registration process. Now it says, hi Paras, it's Tim. I'd like to discuss simplifying the registration process for our meditation app as it currently seems, to uh, seems too complicated for new users. At present, users must download the app, enter their email address and create a password. They then receive an email with a link to confirm their email address before logging in with their chosen password. We noticed many unconfirmed email addresses among new applications. Sounds good, right? Can we make this easier? I'm wondering if it's possible for users to provide their email address upon downloading the app and then receive a one-time login password via email. This way, we won't need to remember passwords and can simply, uh, and can simply access the app through their emails. Is this is feasible and is this feasible and what will be the cost involved? This sounds great, right? And the only thing that I need to do, I, I can, by the way, uh, when I click this button here, I can ask to redo it again. I can now save this note here and I can also see the original. So here is the text and I can also, when I click the original, look at this. This is a lot more text that you're seeing right here, blah, 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 blah. And this is a clear thought that I can use. So I can even uh, duplicate this, copy this, and then I can paste that and send that into my emails or wherever I want to use this. I can delete this and I can also click on this and then I can say I want to change the length, for example. I want to change the style. So when you open the style library, I can also say I want to have this in a different style written so I can rewrite this whole part. I'm not going to do that because I'm satisfied with the result. 
And then another thing that you can do is you can merge multiple um, notes. So as you can see here, I created three notes. So I have here uh, the, the registration process here. Here I have push notifications and here I want to have special access for page users. What I can do now is I can say, I want to have this note, I want to have this note, and I want to have this note, and I want to create a super summary. Now, when I click on this, it's going to merge these notes. So let's say I want to create every thought uh, separately. I can do that. And then it's going to create a super note as if it is one simple message to my developer. Uh, so let me pause the video and come back to you with the results. And there you go, here it has the super summary. Meditation app improvements, registration and features. So here you can see it's very short. Hi Paris, I'd like to discuss some improvements for our meditation apps, uh, specifically simplifying the registration process and adding new features. Currently the registration uh, process is quite complex. Now you can pause the screen and read this. And then it goes to the next thing. Another feature we want is sending push notifications to our users. We'll need a system for scheduling these messages on both Android and iPhone platforms while ensuring that users can receive them properly. And then the last message, could we add a section accessible only by paid subscribers with exclusive music and video content? This would incent incentivize more people to subscribe. Please let me know. And here you can see the original transcription. Look at this. This is, boom, a lot of thoughts, right? And it creates simply a clear message that I can send to my developer. And you can use this for anything that you communicate. You can use this to write your own notes. You can use this to developers. You can use it to write emails. It makes it so much simpler. And the cool thing is when you have a note, I forgot to save this one, by the way, but let's say we want to have this note here. The cool thing is that you can also share this. So that you, let's say you have some very cool thoughts about success or something else. Then what you can do here is when you click on this image, you can create a shareable image that you can share on social media. You can choose here one of the sizes and then you can click on create here. And look at this. It's being created in less than four seconds. Boom. Look at this. Now you got a perfect image that you can share on social media. And you can change the colors of this as well because you have the option in the app itself here to go to the settings at the right top where you can change the colors of this image that has been created. And by the way, uh, you can also change the input language or it will detect your language. You can create an output language so you can say whatever you say, and then it will create it in other language as well. So if you want to send this in the native language of somebody else, you can do that as well. You can change the writing style in here. You can change the output length as well. Uh, and you can integrate this uh, with Zapier as well. Now, these are all the features, uh, except for one that I forgot to show you here at the left bottom here. You can upload audio as well. So when you take your phone, for example, you can record audio or on your watch or wherever, or if you have an MP3 file, you can upload that as well. And you will have 30 uploads per month because the original thought was that you start rambling instead of uploading things. But users were asking for this option. So the developer added these options to AudioPen. Uh, but I think... It's an awesome platform. I'm using it all the time now to make my thoughts easier. And it's so easy. If you're interested in getting this product, there's a link in the description here of this video. Uh, make sure you use coupon TIM20 to get 20% off as well. Uh, so yeah, check out that link. If you have any questions, make sure to ask them in the comments below. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe and like, and uh, talk to you soon. Cheers.